Okay. All right. So come find me on your mat, shall we? Let's head over to the mat. All right, you guys. So we're going to get started nice and easy in a comfortable seated position. Lengthen up through your spine. You're going to reach your arms up by the ears. Just really feel a gentle stretch through your entire spine for a brief moment. Just stay and hold here for five, four, three, two, and one. Good. Now from here, you're going to round your spine, draw the belly button in, curl your tailbone underneath and behind you as you reach your hands towards your knees. You're just going to roll back halfway. Inhale, you're going to roll all the way up. Reach your arms up by your ears. Feel a stretch through the entire spine, lengthening through the crown of your head. Exhale, you're going to round your spine, gently roll back halfway, and reach your hands towards your knees. Slowly rolling all the way up, sitting up nice and tall, arms up by your ears. Lengthening through the entire waist. Exhale, slowly round the spine, curling from your tailbone, rolling halfway, hands towards your knees. Good. Inhale up. Lengthening your spine. Exhale, round. Rolling back halfway. Good job, everyone. I believe you're doing well. Inhale, arms up. And exhale, round the spine, slowly rolling back. Good. Please continue for four more. Inhale. And exhale. Good. Last three, you guys. Inhale, rolling up, sitting tall. Exhale, round the spine, slowly rolling back halfway. Good job. Last two. Inhale, up. And exhale to round. One last one, everyone. Inhale, rolling up. Good. And exhale, you're going to roll down halfway. Reach your hands towards your knees. Stay and hold. Stay and hold it here for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Good job. Now, bring your hands beside your knees. Lift your right leg up to tabletop. You're going to lower your right leg down to tap your mat. Switch, lift your left leg up to tabletop. Lower your left leg down to tap your mat. Exhale, lift your right leg up to tabletop. Lower your right leg down to tap your mat. Good, lift your left leg up to tabletop. Lower your left leg down. Good, I know it's a little bit challenging. Do your best. Continue for another five more on each side. Five. Well done, feet heavy, last four. Keep your pelvis as stable as you can. Four. Good job, everyone. Last three. Three. Last two. Two. Last one. And one. Good job, everyone. Slowly roll all the way down. Lie down on your back. Good job. Bending your knees. This time you can separate your feet as wide as your mat, okay? Your hands are still going to raise up towards the ceiling. Take a deep breath in right here. Exhale, you're going to curl your hips and tailbone gently round your spine, rolling all the way up for full bridge. Inhale at the very top. Exhale, slowly roll back down. Upper back, middle back, lower back, pelvis and tailbone. Articulating through your spine. One bone at a time, slowly rolling all the way up. Inhale at the very top. Exhale, slowly rolling down, articulating through the spine. One bone at a time. Please continue this for another three more. Rolling all the way up. Exhale, slowly rolling all the way back down. Last two, everyone, rolling all the way up. And rolling all the way back down. One last one, everyone. Rolling all the way up. 
Good, and slowly rolling all the way back down. Now when you're ready, find me with your legs lifted in tabletop. You're gonna pull your knees into your chest, give your legs a nice gentle squeeze. Hold on to the back of your head, supporting your neck, your neck and your head. Take a deep breath in. Exhale, you're gonna curl your head, neck and shoulders up. Trying to bring your head all the way up towards your knees. Now from here, you're gonna straighten both legs as you exhale and bend both knees as you inhale. Let's go, when you're ready, exhale to straighten both legs, inhale to bend both knees. Exhale to straighten both legs, inhale to bend both knees. Continue this one at a nine more. Well done everyone, eight, seven, Six, good, five, four, keeping your body lifted, three, last two, and one, good job everyone, bending your knees, lie back down, give your legs a nice gentle squeeze, ah, I see you. All right, now when you're ready, just holding on to your right shin and ankle. You're going to use the pressure of your hands against your shin and ankle to curl up, okay? So you're pushing your shin into your hands to curl your hip, neck, your shoulders up. Straighten your left leg forward. Take a deep breath in. Keep your body lifted. Exhale to switch. Exhale to switch your legs. Inhale to switch. Inhale to switch. Exhale to switch, and switch. Good, continue for another six. Five, five, four, four, last three, two, and one. Good job, making sure you finish with your left knee into your chest, lie back down on your back. Left knee in towards your chest, keeping your bottom right leg straight, Twist and rotate, reaching your left leg up and over to the right side of your body. Stay and hold. Inhale, exhale for five. Inhale, exhale for four. Inhale, exhale for three, two, and one. Good job everyone, now straighten your left leg. Reach your left leg up towards the ceiling. Keeping your left leg straight, bottom right leg straight. You're going to draw small circles with your top left leg. Open up to the side, circle, reach up to the ceiling. Open up to the side, circle, reach up to the ceiling. Continue for five more times, please. Four. Three. Maintaining the stability of your pelvis, two. And one. Good job, everyone. Let's reverse the direction. Small circles. Open. Circle lift. Five more. Four. Three. Two. And one. Good job, everyone. When you're ready, lower and lengthen your left leg to the floor. Once again, pull your right knee into it, your chest. Give your right leg a nice, gentle squeeze. Twist and rotate, reaching your right leg towards the left side of your body. Taking a couple of deep breaths here. Inhale, allowing your ribcage to expand. As your spine continues to lengthen, exhale all the air out. Inhale and exhale. Inhale, exhale for five. Inhale, exhale for four. Inhale, exhale for three, two, and one. Good job, everyone. Once again, same thing. You're going to straighten your right leg first. Bring your right leg up to the ceiling. Stabilize your pelvis. Circle your right leg up to the ceiling. Seven, six, five, four, three, two and one good job everyone reverse the direction for seven six five four three two 
and one. Good job. Two straight legs up to the ceiling. Take a deep breath in. Exhale, you're going to curl up. Allow your hands to support the back of your neck. Keep squeezing your heels together. You're going to slowly lower your legs for three, two, one. Inhale. Exhale, lift your legs up. Slowly lower your legs for three, two, one. Inhale. Exhale, lifting both legs up. Continue for eight, two, three. Exhale up. Seven, two, three. Inhale. Exhale up. Good job. Six, two, three. Inhale. Exhale up. Five, two, three. Exhale, lift. Last four. Exhale. Three. Exhale. Good. Last two. Exhale. Last one, everyone. Exhale. Now stay and hold. Hold on to the back of your right hand. String. Lower and lengthen your left leg down. <clears throat> Lift your body up a little bit more. And scissor your legs to switch. 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 And switch. Good. Switch. Continue for five. Switch five. Last four. Switch four. Good. Three. Switch three. Last two. Keep your body lifted, everyone. Last one. Switch one. Good job. Bend your knees to your chest. Lie back down. Good job, you guys. Well done. Okay, final one. Okay, before we come up, you're going to keep your knees bent, okay? Now, this is a little bit painful. We kind of do our very best, okay? So, what you're going to do is you're going to keep your knees bent. Your knees as close to your chest. Your knee heels as close to your bum. You're going to roll up with as much control as you can, okay? Now, I'm, I'm not... I'm not the model example, so I can't lift all the way up as well, okay? But we do our best, yeah? So you're going to push from the back of your arms, scoop it from the core. You're going to try to roll up as much as you can, and you're going to roll down with control, okay? Some people can roll all the way back. Um, I'm just not one of those, okay? So you're going to try to see if you can roll up as much as you can, okay? Lifting your hips up. And then slowly rolling back down with control. You're gonna get, just give me this for seven more times, okay? Let's go. Scoop to roll up. Rolling back down. Six more. Scoop to roll up. Pushing from the back of your arms. Last five. Last four, everyone. Last three. Two more, everyone. Last one, you guys. All right. <laughs> I'm dead. That was, that was just one of those that is just unnecessarily hard. Okay, let's go. Slowly roll up. Find me in a seated position. I believe you did a great job. You're gonna come and find me on your forearms, okay? So we are gonna do a quick forearm plank before we finish in our hands and knees today, yeah? So nice and easy, find me on your forearms, straighten both legs back behind you. You're gonna stay and hold it here. So you're gonna push back from your heels, feeling a stretch to the back of your leg push forward from your toes. You're just going to give me this for 20 times, okay? Are you ready, everyone? Okay, let's start. All together, knees up, straight legs, pushing forward from your toes and back through your heels for 20. 19, don't let your hips drop. Keep your hips parallel to the ground. 17, 16, forward and back. 15, Forward and back. 14. 13. Well done. 12. 11. Good. 10. 9. 8. 7. 6. 5. 4. 3. 2. 
and one good job you guys lower your knees down and rest for a second finding a quick child's pulse allow the back of your spine to lengthen good job all right so when you're ready if you need your towel bring your towel on your knees yeah so really working with a little bit of spinal articulation next okay so you're still gonna come down on your hands lengthening your spine opening your chest expanding your spine to shift your weight backwards slightly inhale shifting your weight forwards as you round your spine bring the top of the head towards the ground curling your tailbone underneath you inhale shift your weight back open your chest extending your spine exhale to round shifting your weight forward let your head neck and shoulders release Inhale, shift your weight back, extend your spine, open your chest, exhale to round, good, inhale, and exhale, good job, two more times, inhale, exhale, last one, inhale, and exhale okay so we are gonna do the harder one first and then we finish with a stretch today okay so do your very best yeah if you need to rest at any time in between please feel free to take it yeah so two options for this exercise it is not entirely new i believe you've done it before if you've been taking live classes with me okay so first option you're gonna roll the spine forward lower your knees down do a push-up and then come up to your downward dog okay that's version number one version number two you just roll forward through the spine at a push up in between and then find a downward dog now version number three is probably the hardest version you do your very best okay so version number three you're gonna come down on your forearms first shift your weight forward in your push up position Press up through your shoulders and then find your downward dog, okay? So any of the three options will do, okay? So remember version number one, just shift forward, bring your knees down, push up. Version number two, roll forward with your knees off and push up. Version number three, just adding that tricep press, okay, with straight legs. All right, now whichever your choice, you're going to give me this for 10 times, all right? Let's get it all together 10 times. Let's go. So straight legs, straight arms. Try to see if you can lengthen your spine fully in your downward dog. Nice and easy. Version number one, two or three, let's go. Really trying to articulate through your spine, even as you roll through and forward. We've got eight more times, you guys, rolling through the spine as you shift forward. Seven more. I believe you're doing well. Six more. Good. Last five. Four. Keeping the center of the body supported throughout. Last three. Last two. One last one, everyone. Good job. Slowly roll through the spine, finding on your knees as promised, finishing with a nice easy stretch. Okay, so you're gonna place your right hand behind your ear and twist and rotate, pushing down through your bottom left hand. Inhale right here, exhale, you're going to rotate your spine through. You can even thread and reach your right hand towards the ground. As you push down with your bottom left hand, trying to twist and rotate your chest up to the ceiling a little bit more, keeping your hips square. Now, inhale, you're going to press upwards through that bottom left hand. Inhale, lift and rotate the spine upwards more. And exhale, you're going to rotate down once again. Pushing from the bottom, left hand, good. So we are gonna lift your body up just for one last time. Press up, 
and rotate up as you inhale. Exhale, you're gonna rotate down. Straighten your right hand. Good, and then this time, finally, either pushing down from your left hand or if you want, you can even reach your left arm up by your ear, okay? Lengthening your spine as you rotate up. Now, if you want even more, you can even straighten your right leg backwards behind you as well. Keeping your spine long. Stay for five, four, three, two, and one. Good job, everyone. Bring your knees down. Slowly bring your body back to center. Now, when you're ready, nice and easy, keeping your spine and waist long, you're going to place your left hand behind your ear this time, okay? So left hand behind your ear, same thing, you're rotating up, inhale, rotating down as you exhale, threading the needle, just keeping your bottom right elbow bent, pressing upwards through the bottom right arm, twist to rotate up as you inhale, exhale, rotate down. Threading your left arm through, pushing down through the bottom right hand. Now we've got one last time. Inhale, you're going to lift up, rotating up. Exhale, you're going to rotate down. Please stay and hold. Version number one, same thing, keep your head in front of you. Version number two, you can even bring your right arm up by your ear. Now if you once even more, you can even straighten your left leg back behind you, but do your best to still keep your hips even. Rotating your chest upwards to the ceiling, stay and hold. Five, four, three, two, and one. Good job, everyone. Lower both knees. Lengthen the spine. Walk your hands back, tuck your toes underneath you, walk your hands back towards your feet. Good, you're going to slowly attempt to straighten your legs. Good. Now from here, we're just going to bend your knees and straighten your legs for five times, letting your head, neck and shoulders release. Four, three, two, and one good job everyone keeping your legs straight you're gonna round your spine take your time slowly rolling all the way up to stand now finishing in a tall standing position and i just wanted to say you guys did an absolutely amazing job this morning well done kudos to you guys all the options y'all it's great to see all of you. I hope you enjoyed class. Um, and I look forward to seeing you again tomorrow.